Hey, Helium here. Welcome to episode 14, 14 of Descent Free Space The Great War. After the quick and intense Red Alert scramble mission with our under-equipped Apollos, I hope we will get something better this time, at least some decent ship load out, because I don't like ML-16s. Well, let's see what the universe has in store for us now. Control, this is boarding party Bravo 2, entering disabled freighter. Roger, Bravo 2. Keep the chatter to a minimum. Light has decimated the Vasudan fleet at Vega. Most of the surviving Vasudan forces have retreated to Deneb and Antares. Because our fleet is also holding Antares, relations between the VPE and the GTA have been strained. In order to quell the tension, we have been ordered to eliminate all Hammer of Light outposts in the vicinity. Fortunately, we have some new tools to assist us. Our first new weapon is the Phoenix 5 anti-bomber warhead. This missile can puncture even the thickest of shields and can also be used effectively against larger targets, like freighters. More details are available in the tech room. Okay, so the interceptor is the anti-fighter um, aspect-seeking missile and the Phoenix 5 is the anti-bomber one. We have also acquired a wing of the new Medusa bombers. Though they are slower and less maneuverable than the Athena, they are far more powerful. Once again, full details can be found in the tech room. Remember the Athena, the brick. <sighs> this one's worse. The new tsunami bomb is the ultimate anti-cruiser weapon. It can be carried by the Medusas. Just a few of these will take out any cruiser, and the Hammer of Light Aten class cruisers are no exception. You'll be using this bomb quite often against major Hammer of Light outposts. Ah, great. Here in the Antares system, we have detected a small HOL base of operations. Your squadron is being sent to eliminate it. You will destroy all Hammer of Light ships, then jump back to the Galate. The Galate will be monitoring you in case the situation gets out of control. Phew! Good luck. You will destroy all Hammer of Light. Gamma has Medusa, huh? Look at this, it's it, it's an even worse brick than this one. This one was bad. Alright, so we have... Oh, our first incompatibilities. Um, a 
Apollos can't use our new and shiny Phoenix Fives. Hmm. Can Darkreach use him? Darkreach can use him. So, so I'll fly a Valkyrie then. Well, I do like my Furies, but I like Interceptors as well. Hmm. Seriously, no way.
Alright, that's one down. GTAR 64-2A, you are hereby promoted to the rank of lieutenant. Congratulations. So. We are pleased that you were able to suppress the Shivan influence in the Beta Aquilae system. Their arrival was unexpected, and battling the Shivans always takes a heavy toll on our forces. Fortunately, we can take some bitter comfort in the fact that they helped us eliminate the Hammer of Light presence in Beta Aquilae. In light of your recent achievements in protecting GTA space from the Shivan threat, we are awarding you with the Distinguished Service Cross. You are truly an outstanding pilot. Nice. So, Lieutenant and the Distinguished Service Cross. Well, that's a good haul for this episode. I'll hope to see you again next time. Bye.